Before coming to a proper understanding of any of the mystical doctrines of the Christian faith, whether it be the doctrines of salvation, of the Holy Trinity, or of others, one must first build for himself a true foundation, knowing the basics of monotheism, that God is one, infinite, and above all, incomprehensible to man. Let's learn about divine simplicity. So, what is it? The Christian dogma, the doctrine of divine simplicity, sometimes known by the acronyms DDS and ADS, is the teaching that God is simple and that he is not complex. Not simple as in easy to understand, but simple in the sense that he is not composed of parts, that he does not have different things within himself. To better understand the term simple, think of the difference between simple and complex carbohydrates. One is a solitary sugar molecule, whereas the other is composed of a few of them. DDS teaches that God is one in substance and not merely in being, but everywhere the same within himself. God is not like a man who is composed of both soul and body, and whose body is even composed of many parts. But he is an absolutely simple and solitary substance, and, in reality, God is identical to and numerically one and the same with his boundless existence. What follows from this truth is the fact that God does not have within himself wisdom existing as one thing and love as another, but because of his simplicity, Whatever God has, he is, and so it is written by St. John the Disciple, God is love. So, though we can conceive of these many different created concepts, usually known as attributes, for example, love and wisdom, in reality, God's love is the same thing as his wisdom, and his wisdom is the same as his essence and nature. St. Dionysius, a first century church father and a disciple of St. Paul the Apostle, wrote, This treatise seeks to celebrate these, the names of God, goodness and cause of all good things, and being and life and wisdom. But it does not affirm that the good is one thing and the being another, and that life is other than wisdom, nor that the causes are many. St. Augustine of Hippo, another early church father, said this about DDS. It is not one thing for God to be and another to be great, since his greatness is the same as his power, and his essence the same as his greatness. We hope that this helped you understand more about this doctrine, and if it did, consider liking and maybe sharing with a friend. Be sure to follow us to receive more helpful Christian content, and most importantly, keep spreading light to others.